Hi and welcome back to my channel. This is Jenny from Lasheni 21 Nails. Today's video is another nail art fail, but this time I went a little overboard with the decorations. Let's see what happened. I started off by applying my cuticula peel off base coat on all my nails, and then I applied this green nail polish from LA Colors Glows Collection. I decided to apply this Revlon glitter polish called Winter Mint on two of my nails. And I wanted to use my nail polish from Sinful Colors Hypnotic Transforming Top Coat. This one is called Red Rum. I applied the green polish and then while it was still wet, I applied the red nail polish. One thing I keep forgetting about this nail polish is that you cannot apply a lot of it, otherwise the transforming effect will not show up as well. So I tried to cover it up by applying more of the green and then covering it up with more of the red, but it was a disaster. It didn't turn out how it's supposed to. By the time I got to my pinky, I kind of got it down, but still a lot of polish comes off of the brush and it doesn't show up as nicely. For some reason, I thought it wasn't sparkly enough, so I decided it would be a good idea to apply this red Milani glitter. I wanted to create two nail decals for the green nail, so I used my Born Pretty Plate Celebration BPXL008. To stamp, I used my red Sally Hansen nail polish called Let's Jam. For the next image, instead of making a decal, I decided to stamp it directly onto my nail and I did that off camera with my white polish and this stamper. But since the white isn't showing up as much, I'm going to do a double stamping. To add more color, I decided it would be a good idea to use a marker to fill in the candle. I used the yellow for the flame and red for the bow. And then I went back to fill in the candy cane image with the white polish. And I used a red nail polish for the bow. And as if that wasn't enough, I decided that I wanted to try this white glitter nail polish to add more of a snow effect. When I placed the candy cane decal directly onto my nail, I noticed that the red bow wasn't popping enough, so I went over it with a black Sharpie marker. And even though I really didn't like the way it looked, I decided that the other bow had to have the black border too because now they looked really different. After applying top coat, I'm finally done with this manicure and it is horrible. I just couldn't stop. I don't know what happened. I just kept going and kept going until this is what I ended up with. Thank you so much for taking the time to watch this video, for subscribing to my channel and for liking my videos. I hope you have a wonderful day. Bye!